An investigation will reveal what happened to two British aid workers who in Ukraine because the family of a family is probably executed by the Wagner Group paid Askins. 28-year-old Chris Perry and 47-year-old Andrew Bagshaw disappeared in January last year trying to evacuate civilians from Soledar on Eastern Front in the middle of heavy war. It is believed that they have saved hundreds of lives among them, withdrawing people from rubble in newly rescued towns and villages. A forensic medical man is expected to end the investigation into Mr. Perry's death during a hearing in Oxford today. Andrew Bagshaw and Christopher Perry disappeared near Sleledar when they were lost. United Kingdom Foreign Ministry said that couple had been killed by artillery shell but Mr. Bagshaw's family said that results of autopsy have revealed a darker fact. Andrew's father, Professor Philip Bagshaw told Sky News to Sky News from his home in New Zealand. He referred to a post-death examination for Andrew, showing that the results showed that his son was hit on the body and once. He described it as a classic executive style and said that his wife Dame Sue Bagshaw in Ukraine claimed that the people they talked about were carried out by Wagner troops. Professor Bagshaw said that the wounds that Mr. Perry was exposed to were almost the same. Mr. Perry's family did not comment on everyone about Bagshaw's claims Chris Perry evacuated Ukrainian civilians from recently rescued villages be the first to get news. Install the Sky News app for free in days following disappearance couple. Wagner leader Yevgeny Prigozhin published a photo of passports bearing names Mr. Bagshaw and Mr. Perry. Since the death of their sons, Professor Bagshaw and Dame Sue have been collecting money for Ukraine with a monumental confidence. We are very proud of him, Dame Sue said. We are really proud of the fact that was his own man. Did not compare himself with anyone did what thought was right. He spoke in front of Mr. Perry's investigation and called on to investigate whether a war crime of the United Kingdom was committed. Please use the Chrome browser for a more accessible video player 233 Chris Perry speaks with Sky. News on November 2022 hundreds of running coaches from Ukrainian fronts initially. Mr. Perry, who was from Cornwall spent months by entering rescued villages in the most dangerous parts of facade line he saved hundreds of civilians in 2022 he spoke to sky news and his experiences including being crusty by russian artillery in ukraine after death in ukraine his family said selfless determination to help people make them extremely proud it is impossible to throw in words how much to be missed but it will be in our hearts forever.